Thank you for spending a few minutes with me to learn more about Tango TX1's 1.8 firmware. If what you've heard is intriguing and you'd like to upgrade, there's two ways you can do that. First, if you have a DSXi cloud-connected docking station, it's easy. Go to iNet Control, schedule your firmware upgrade, and the next time a Tango TX1 is docked, it'll be upgraded to 1.8, and you can start taking advantage of all the great new features. Uh, if you don't have a DSXi, uh, you'll need to contact your local industrial scientific representative or authorized service center for more information on how to upgrade, and they'll take care of you. Quick note on compatibility. For DSXi, you'll want to make sure that you have version 7.0.5 of that docking station firmware or higher. And if you're a DSXL user or DSSAC user, you'll want to make sure that you've got version 9.6 or higher. If you don't use either of those uh, and you want to take advantage of 1.8, you can do, still do so. Um, most of the settings that we've talked about here can be configured on the instrument's setting menu, uh, which you can access on startup. Uh, the only exception is the dock do triggers. Those can only be set through software. So with that, I'd like to thank you uh, for uh, again for spending time with me about 1.8 of Tango's firmware, and keep safe.